people if you're thinking of buying the prototype biohazard bundle if i was you i would hold off buying that especially if you're going to buy it on the xbox one because get this the prototype biohazard bundle which is prototype one and two with all the dlc actually runs slower than the playstation 3 version now as you probably know prototype one and two has been released as a biohazard hd edition uh, it's on xbox one at the moment for 39.99 which i'm last way too steep especially for those two games when if you pick another game that came out let's have a look say the saints row bundle which is saints row 4 and get out of hell you can pick that up for 25 quid and you get all the dlc with it as well but no this is basically prototype 2 has actually been described as among the worst performing games on xbox one now i've got an article from digital spy i'll leave a link below in the description but they say that your gamer put both prototype games through the paces on xbox one and the results were disappointing while both games output at 1080p, the frame rate dips below 30 frames per second when explosions are triggered in the original game. Sequel is described as more of an ordeal to play with an even lower frame rate and intrusive effect. Here's what the article on Eurogamer has to say. And I quote, From the word go, cutscenes stutter by a frame rate every time the camera cuts to a new angle. Emerge into Manhattan's complex of skyscrapers, most of the game's traversal then unfolds at around 20 to 25 frames per second. That's shocking. With highly intrusive screens here, it's absolutely amongst the worst performing games on Xbox One to date, despite its relatively modest origins. When we go to the last gen, the PS3 edition is said to be consistently better than both Xbox versions, and that's Xbox One and Xbox 360, considering xbox one should have an upgraded more upgraded hardware than the playstation 3 that's actually shocking but i don't understand why you would pay 40 quid for the entire bundle if you own one of the last gen consoles um you can pick them both up for at least at most a tenner you can even pick them up for a five on amazon and that's i'm talking about prototype one and two so if you are thinking of getting the biohazard bundle especially if you're on the xbox one if I was you, I'd best avoid it for the time being. This is James of Welsh Gamer News logging off. Take care.